Hey, it's Randy Tiber out here in Arizona. Today I'm going to a bike show at Chandler Harley Davidson and I'm going to enter my street bob and see if anybody cares and uh, try to promote my channel a little bit and uh, just enjoy being out for the day. I hope you're all doing well out there and uh, enjoying the weekend and uh, maybe getting out and doing some riding. Going down the 101 freeway here, 101 South, down to the 202 loop, which runs across the south end of the valley. Chandler Harley is on the, the south end of Phoenix, or Chandler actually, on the way on the road to Tucson. Traffic's fairly uh, light today, not too bad. I ride this road a lot when I go on to work. It's all very familiar to me. Nice day, it's in the 60s. It's going to be 76 today before the day's over. Got out yesterday, did a video. If you hadn't had a chance to watch it, uh, please do. It's, it's It seems to get a slow start, but uh, that's okay. You know, everybody's busy, I understand that. Kind of stalled on subscribers here lately. Uh, that does happen on YouTube from time to time. And and you get subscribers that are nothing but bots, and YouTube removes them eventually. So it goes up and down. And uh, You know, I never expected to have thousands of subscribers, but, you know, I do appreciate everybody that has subscribed and the shares my videos and likes my videos and I do get to talk to people from around the world and that's awesome. Coming up on Elliott Road here. This is where I get off to go to work. When people ask me where do you get off? Well it's right there. Had a good day yesterday. It was nice and uh, uh, mellow out and uh, a little windy. Uh, I was out on the bike. I got blown around a little bit, but uh, it still felt good. My fairing uh, does a good job of uh, creating a pocket of dead air so I'm not, my body's not getting bounced around like uh, bikes I had back in the day before I would use a fairing or anything or a windshield. Or, it's funny, since my, I had my 2015 Dyna, I, everything I've had has had a windshield or a little quarter fairing or something. Actually, going back to a uh, 96 Sportster I had, I had a little quarter fairing on it, that a uh, little bikini fairing that actually blocked more air than you would believe. And it looked really cool on there. And, and so I had that style of bike before it was popular. But... Uh, I don't know, it's popular out here in the west, uh, back east, I watch videos of Daytona and Laconia and whatever, and you don't see many west coast style, uh, there's a guy on a bagger, you don't see many west coast style bikes back in the east, uh, I guess it's just not the style, they've always had a big difference in style in the east as versus the west, and the midwest is, well, pardon the pun, but somewhere in the middle. To me, having a fairing on the bike is, is not, yeah, I mean, there's a style element there, but to me, it's about comfort and wind protection, and uh, uh, yeah, it just, uh, to me, it looks sporty, and, uh, you know, hot rod dynas became a thing over in California, and it spread, and it's one of the coolest things I've ever seen, and I've had baggers, I've had several dynas, couple soft tails and I seem to go back and forth between bikes that uh, are meant for the highway and I never get time to get out too far so for me blasting around short trips running around town it's good but it's really really helpful to have this windshield out in front of you but that's the soapbox today is uh, I do like that but anyway I'm going to be headed west here to Chandler here and I will do some more video here when I get to the show. This is Randy T-Bird and we will talk to you. Well it's Randy back. I'm back here at Chandler Harley now and uh, got Lucky 13 for the bike show and we'll see how that goes. 
See if anybody uh, got to straighten that out. See if anybody likes my bike. As you can see, there's a lot of bikes here in the show. Got a dyno thing going on here. I'm not sure where all the show is. Some Kawasaki's. And a million earlys, of course. dyno truck here that's pretty fancy the dyno there got the eagle eye paint scheme on that bike cool any big horsepower yet Huh? Getting any big horsepower yet? Uh, 130. That's pretty big. That was a cool Dyna. Right on. I miss my Dyna sometimes. Got quite a big crowd out here today. 33, that's not my thing, but I can appreciate the artistry. It's an interesting color. It's an older Road King. We got flat hot dogs coming. How do? Are they ready yet? Yo, you like a dollar and chip and a soda? Absolutely. Alright, All right, back with more bikes. Here's a new Pan America. You guys got some cool stuff on that already. I like the axe, that's that's a nice touch. Definitely going out into the wilderness. He's got dirty tires, so he's been out in the dirt. Again, I'm at Chandler Harley Davidson today and our bike show and horsepower challenge. It's an old shovel head back. Uh, here it's got a siren on it. That's pretty cool. Old generator shovel. Buddy of mine's got one of those. Some painters. Nice stuff. Nice stuff. You're gonna be famous. I've got 600 subscribers. <laughs> well, not that famous. Semi famous. So you got music and food and drink and motorcycles, how can you lose? It's a nice heritage. Kind of reminds me of the one that I had. I do miss that bike from time to time. Cotton candy, kettle corn, 
what I need with a bad tooth. It's like a victory. All custom, customed out. Nice paint. 13, who owns this bike? I think I know that guy. Nice bike. Anyway, more later. Well, this is Randy T Bird. Okay, we're finishing up the day. The bike show is over. They had a guy there on the dyno run 153 horsepower. That's pretty, pretty amazing. That was a turbo, uh, Trask turbo. Some other guys did some in the 120s, 130s. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I hung around for the day. Had a had a free hot dog. Just uh, hung out and enjoyed the nice weather and uh, bikes coming and going. Talking to a few people. But anyway, now I'm headed back toward the hacienda. This is Randy T Bird out in Arizona. Hope you enjoy the video today. Please subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Um, make sure you like and share my videos. Hit this, uh, the button to be notified and uh, you'll get my videos. Anyways, Randy T-Bird, I'm out.